Hi friends. Welcome to a new learning video on Pharma Guideline. Today we will understand all five root cause analysis tools used in the pharmaceutical industry. Root cause analysis is a critical tool used in the pharmaceutical industry to identify the underlying cause of a problem or defect. Several root cause analysis tools can be used in the pharma industry depending on the problem's complexity and the available resources. Here are some of the commonly used root cause analysis tools in the pharmaceutical industry. 5Y tool. The 5 Ys is a simple yet effective root cause analysis technique that involves asking why a problem occurred 5 times to arrive at the root cause. It's a commonly used technique in the pharma industry because it's easy to use and doesn't require any special skills or resources. Fishbone Diagram The Fishbone Diagram, also known as Ishikawa Diagram, is a visual tool used to identify the possible causes of a problem. The diagram resembles a fish skeleton, with the problem at the head, and the possible causes branching out like bones. This tool is particularly useful when there are multiple potential causes of a problem. Pareto Chart The Pareto Chart is a graphical tool used to identify the most significant contributing factors to a problem. It's based on the Pareto Principle, which states that 80% of the effects come from 20% of the causes. This tool is particularly useful when there are several contributing factors to a problem, and resources need to be focused on the most significant ones. Fault Tree Analysis The Fault Tree Analysis is a comprehensive RCA tool used to analyze complex problems with multiple causes. FTA uses a graphical representation of the problem, with the problem at the top and the various possible causes branching out like a tree. This tool is particularly useful when the problem is complex and has multiple contributing factors. Failure Mode and Effects Analysis The Failure Mode and Effects Analysis, FMBA, is a proactive RCA tool used to identify potential failures before they occur. FMBA involves systematically reviewing a process or system to identify potential failures, the effects of those failures, and the likelihood of occurrence. This tool is particularly useful in the pharma industry to identify potential risks in the manufacturing and quality control processes. The choice of the root cause analysis tool depends on the complexity of the problem, available resources, and the level of detail required to identify the root cause. Pharmaceutical companies can choose the appropriate RCA tool based on their specific needs and requirements. In the next videos, we will discuss these five tools one by one. So stay tuned to learn these tools in detail. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and also hit the bell icon to get regular updates. Thanks for watching this video.